take my grill off. Got this, this napkins here. The smorgasbord. Look at the smorgasbord. Uh, Is it listed? Yeah, I made it. Uh, made it public. Public. It's public. Yeah, it's probably it's taking a minute. Yeah, it's a big ass fry. This shit looks like a sword. <laughs> it does. These onion rings, too. Mm. What up, y'all? Oh, there you are. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, we are at Fat Burger for this. Uh, what are we calling this? On the field? Mm hmm. On the, the field, field trainer. In the field. Yes. I've never had Fat Burger before. I know it's an LA staple, but. Never just got around to it. Plus, I, they all look a little sketchy at a certain hour, so I've always just kind of avoided it. It's also where, um, what's his face? It's a parking lot, sir. Unnecessary. Completely unnecessary. It's where T.I. swung on uh, Floyd Mayweather. Oh, snap. Yeah, that's, just, that's, historic, uh, that's a historic moment. Okay, go uh -huh. But um, I'm from L.A., so of course I've had Fat Burger. I did not know they had uh, hot dogs, though. Mm-hmm. You know I had to order Glizzy. The chili cheese. You know I had to order Glizzy. So we are at the Fat Burger. I'll show you guys mine too. Because I want you to see all. First of all, before I do that though. On, uh, where's this one at? Vermont. Vermont. Vermont and Hollywood. Just north of Sunset. Iconic Street. And this one has been here for a while. You can tell by how that bad boy is spinning. <laughs> it has been here for a while. Um, we are on the field, so we're gonna try to talk as loud as possible because the cars are man, trucks the trucks just all woke up. Man, right now. it's ridiculous. So <laughs> I'll show you what I'm working with real quick. This is crazy. This is supposed to be a protein style burger. On the picture it was wrapped up, but they gave it to me. Just <laughs> burger insides. <laughs> just a pile of burger. Yeah, I so and I was like, I thought it was gonna look like that. She was like, Yeah, we got our letters are shredded. I was like, what does that have to do? Cause it's supposed to be the burger as the bread, right? And then all the toppings in between. But oh, the meat was supposed to be the bread. Yeah, the, the meat was supposed to be the bread. Oh, That's no. how it was on the picture inside. So I thought it was gonna look like that when they handed me this. I was like, what the hell is this? Yeah, what's? Well, and she was like, well, we can make it over. I'm like, well, why wouldn't you make it right the first time? You didn't make it that time. That's it's like <laughs> toppings. I remember I was in St. Louis one time and I had to get a haircut and I didn't have a barber in St. Louis, so I just mm -hmm. went to this random one and this guy's cut my hair and I feel he's cutting it wrong. It's very rare that you feel the barber's cutting your hair wrong. The angles? Pushing it back. Pushing uh, it back. Lining uh, wasn't straight. Uh -huh. All of that. So I told him, yo, bro, this is back when I'm shooting a drop. I was like, bro, I shoot a, a, a morning talk show every morning. He was like, oh, man, you should have told me that. Why Why would I have to tell you that? <laughs> I would have given you a good haircut. Why won't you just do your job correctly to I begin been a with? I would barber. I don't, I don't understand that. That's hilarious. That, <laughs> that did, one don't did he mess it up, though? Was it bad? He messed it up, bro. I didn't pay him. That's uh, the first time and only time I've ever walked on of a barber. You saying that? Did you go back? Me, no, absolutely. It, was, it wasn't even in the area I was familiar with. I was just out there. I was talking with my. You were rolling the dice. Man, everything about it was a gamble. And I lost big. Oof. The house won that day. That's crazy. when it came down to be paid because I was like, deuces. So, I have the uh, protein style burger. I have the onion rings. Onion rings are decent. I already tasted one of those. Pat has the. Um, Impossible Burger, his burger actually looks amazing. Yeah, Impossible. He has the Impossible Burger, he has uh, regular, regular duck fries, and then duck we have fries. the chili cheese duck fries, and the chili cheese glizzy. All right, so that's that's what we're doing. And looks flames. we had to had to try the shakes out. All right? oh, yeah. I got a got banana strong. Maui, he got a strawberry. Banana Maui, wow, that's yeah. pretty good. I'm gonna, you know, that's I don't good. really do shakes like that. So, what's first? Let's oh, jump yes. right into why you need to sign up for True Bill, yeah. okay? Because True Bill will help you save money. You know how it is when we sign up for stuff online. We're like, oh man, this was great. Give you one week, they give you two weeks, and then they sign you up automatically. They, they're so sneaky with it. And then they make it so difficult to cancel. You, why can't I cancel from my phone if I signed up on my phone? I, I, just, I don't understand that. And if you, if you can cancel your phone, you gotta go through 16 different prompts or oh, you gotta hunt for it. you can't just go to subscription though it's not a subscription right you have to actually go to the app why y'all doing this they doing it to get our money why? well you know what i say no more sign up for true bill see how much money you can save every month on average people save about eight hundred dollars a year eight hundred dollars a year that's a lot signing up for true bill so you should sign up for true bill right now see what you can do see what you can save 
I mean, we're in the field, guys. This big truck. We're, we're in the field. We're in the field. Birds. Pat, pull it up. Let them know what what, what, what they can say. Because I'm going to hit you guys. Sorry, guys. This this is the craziest gracious. fat burger ever. There was yeah. just a murder. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> to be fair, we are right next to a hospital. But anyway. Oh, right, right. Sign up True Bill at truebill.com slash scary lunch. Mm -hmm. uh, see how much money you can save. Trust me, this is something you want to do. It's your money. Why not save it? Huh? <laughs> And how about Matthew B, who saved eight hundred and forty dollars? Oh, year. okay, or, Matthew. Or Becca with the good hair, one hundred and eighty-seven dollars in unused recurring subscriptions. Wow. Well, I I know I have some. I'm definitely gonna do it because I I had um what's the cartoon one? And I just was not using it. I was like, why am I still? Why do I still have this on my phone? Boomerang. Boomerang. I have it, but I just never I forgot. It's Man. actually offloaded itself. So go to truebill.com slash scary lunch. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and save your money. Put it back in your pocket where it belongs. Tell me sent you. True Bill. True Bill. Let's get into it. You ready? Yeah, I'm hungry. All right. I want to try one of these fries before they get cold, though. So okay, I'm gonna... I already pulled this one out. All right. I'm going to try a regular duck fry first. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Huh? Oh. Uh. Needs ketchup. Yeah. Dry as hell. That's a good carb, though. That's... I miss carbs. It is dry. I don't mind. But ketchup, right. ketchup would make it fire. Mm hmm The chili looks good though. Uh-huh. Oh, 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 oh. You see that you see that cheese hanging off of that thing like that though? This is all it needed. Ooh. That's good. Mm-hmm. The chili's good. Mm-hmm. Some places have chili cheese fries with bad chili. That was alright right now. Oh, come I mean, on. since we come on. Get one more. We'll get one more of them things. Before I go on to the chili cheese dog, before I get into this burger dog. Oh man, this this automatically feels like the chili that's gonna that's gonna it's gonna get some payback. Oh, it's gonna be bubbly. Oh yeah. Oh, you wanted to eat me? Oh, <laughs> wow. Mm-hmm. That chili is fire. It is. I'm going. I'm gonna cut this bad boy in half. Oh, glizzy. Glizzy God. You this know last what I'm time y'all shared a glizzy, huh? <laughs> Don't make weird, bro. Uh, yeah. What's <laughs> As I said it. <laughs> Here's the thing, guys. We were just in Vegas. We partied so hard, we forgot to do this while we were in Vegas, which is dumb because we have so many options. It's a lot of food options. It's a lot of food options in, 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 in Vegas. So, yeah. Here we go. Right. Glizzy. Half the chili cheese glizz that I didn't even know existed. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's pretty good. There's That's barely, good chili cheese on. There's barely any glizzy. Yeah, they cut it in half, put it on a grill, and they put it in the bun, cut it in half. I think your mama used to do the, the polo sausage in the morning. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's really good. I just got barely any glizzy. This was some flaccid glizzy. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I knocked my three of them back. I would probably eat this chili by itself, low key. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not on the board. It's not on. <laughs> I'm not done like real, man. Why would it? I'll pay for it later. Mm hmm. You, you gotta be crazy to eat this chili cheese dog and chili fries at the same time. You're a madman. At the same time. You be dog. a madman. Are oh, you hitting the. I had to wash that down. It was a lot. I, mean, I haven't had one. All right. Yet. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Here's the thing about onion rings, though. If you don't eat them fresh, it's done. It can't, can't. It's just the, yeah. It's just you know, and it, this came out pretty fresh. This has good onion to batter ratio though. Sometimes mm -hmm. it's too battery. It's still good, and it ain't. Even, it's not even room temperature anymore. Cause I ain't really lose heat fast. Did, did we lose you guys? You guys still here? No, they still here. I think our, our audio went down for a minute. Okay. Eating a, eating chili cheese fries and a chili dog at the same time. 
Oh, pretty I, intense. Alright. Pretty intense. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well you can you can dive right in your burger. I actually have to cut mine up like a salad. Okay. I'm gonna try the milkshake. Oh, you wanna go straight to that? I'll just do dessert, dessert first. Yeah. Why not? Because I, I see the cream on the top is melted. Mm -hmm. I kinda hate that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got the strawberry. Ooh, that bad boy, big boy, though. Oh, this shake thick as hell, boy. This shake got an OnlyFans page, boy. Mm -hmm. It's been so long since I had a shake. That's crazy. We gotta pick a less busy spot next time. We, hell yeah. <laughs> this is a new this is a new segment, guys. We were thinking about doing it in the car, but like they gave us food and trays, and this is something you can't sit down and eat like in the car you got to be standing up mm -mm. anybody who pulls up to their house with a pile of burger <laughs> a pile of burger this is one of the best shakes i've mm -hmm. ever had i've ever had damn that's good you right though i don't know why we shoved uh, dessert in the middle but mm. this uh, is crazy chili milkshake <laughs> oh man back to me everything about this meal says we don't care about ourselves right now yeah. <laughs> Everything about this. All right. Well, I'm gonna just. I'm gonna just. I don't even know. I'm just gonna cut something. I got the impossible. This is not meat. Mm-hmm. Mine is. Give me the meat. It's pretty... Hell no. <laughs> I mean. Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I saw a meme today that was like. <laughs> Me getting my hoochie daddy shorts taken off and it was dude laying back with yeah. the guy. Yeah, but he had the low, he had the tats on the chest and everything. All right, here we go. I went through a lot of emotions with this bite. The first mm. initial was like, mm. and then after it, it, it gets really planty. Does it? Very planty aftertaste. Mm. This is fire, however. Wow. So, so that's a sophisticated way to eat a burger. Ma'am. I don't know what that season is beef with, but it's really good. The real stuff. Hey, to be fair, mm. this ain't fat burgers, you know, this ain't they bag. The real stuff is. So, like I said, this see reminds me of uh, a water burger. Mm. And I love water burger, boy. I love it. I go to Texas, stop in there immediately. I think the closest one is in, closest location is. I know they got something in, in Arizona, maybe Phoenix, but. Do you think I that would have been better with with or without bread? Mm, I think it's, it's I think it's equally as good without the bread. Um, bread gets you full faster, and it ain't like they buns are like Hawaiian mm -hmm. Hawaiian rolls or something like that. You know what I'm saying? So all the flavors gonna be in here, and I got all the flavors. So. Mhm. Mm I wish this was real. Mmm. It's good though. That's it's good. good though. Mm. I got, I got it. Okay. Oh, but you had this before, so you yeah, already know. I'm good. Okay. Mm -hmm. The impossible. Mm. Not for me. <laughs> I think I would get the chili dog again. Mm -hmm. And then this is just some pretty good basic lemonade. Mm. That's fire. I'm a fan. All right, so. Time for rating? Should we go to the, yep. Yeah. All right. Um. Let's start with the, where we start? We started with the fries, right? Mm, oh yeah, yeah, regular. So regular fries. Low key, we didn't use the the ranch, which is why they were dry. But it was decent. It was still decent. Mm, I'd give them by themselves like a six. Yeah, they're, they're duck fries, they're fat fries, steak fries, whatever you want to call them. That's some girth. <laughs> it's pretty girthy. They're smitty fries. Smitty. Um, yeah, I would give it like a, um, hmm. Six is there. Yeah, it wasn't seasoned, um, but it wasn't cold. It still was a good fry. Mine had like a seasoned tip. Oh no, it was just burnt. Yeah, yeah. So six for me as well. Now the chili cheese fries. Chili cheese fries. That might be like an eight and a half for me. Mmm. See, I was landing right down that nine. I was too. Fries, I don't know why. Why I backed off it. Was amazing. The chili is great. Cheese is good. And with that fry, soaking it up, so when you bite into the fry, you get a little bit of that chili oil in there. Mmm. It's like eating chili with a soft cracker, almost. Mm. Yeah. 
They didn't. Right. They, they prepared it good too. They didn't like just dump on the chili. Mm -hmm. It's like a good, good little ratio. We yeah. both had quite a bit, and it's still, mm -hmm. still pretty chilly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll give it a nine. Yeah, I'm, 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 sitting, I'm, sitting, I'm sitting right there at the nine, baby. I'll bump sitting it up. The point, I'm sitting fine at the nine. Uh, onion rings. Huh? Yeah. I probably had a five with yeah, them. Yeah. They were five good. Is, five is decent. I will say the batter was good, and I do appreciate the batter ratio to the onions, like Pat said. Mm -hmm. um, but that was just I. Mainly because um, they were a little cool. They had got cool. We had to get situated and everything like that. Mm -hmm. But, um, yeah, just, just, just all right. Hey, shout out to the tip. What's his name? Pretty Tone. <laughs> oh, Pretty Tony with the garlic. Oh, and the roast. <laughs> Why you just gonna <laughs> let it live with just the, the tip, Tone? Why you ain't just give us the tip? <laughs> Pause. <laughs> just <a tip. laughs> We were just, just talking. It was like if it wasn't a marketing nightmare, Eat Me Out would be an amazing name for the show. Yeah. Eat Me Out. Because <laughs> we're also outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Speaking of just a tip, the Glizzy. Glizzy. Glizzinator. <laughs> Glizzy 4000. I loved it. That might have been my favorite thing. I'm leaning toward that right now. Here's the thing. It was really good, and I said I can knock down three. Three would be excessive. After That's two, crazy. I'm like, I need a nap. <laughs> That's crazy. You know what it is though? I love hot dogs. So mm -hmm. like I can knock down like three barbecue hot dogs, easy peasy. But with that chili on there, you ain't you ain't just you ain't throwing that back like that. After that Let's second one, you gotta you gotta take a breather. Breathe, 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 breathe a little bit. Right, I'm, I'm giving gonna... a chili dog a 10. 10 out of 10? Out the gate. And I'm gonna tell you why. I've had chili dogs from other places. Mm -hmm. Steak and shake. I've had them for um uh what's the one with the W out here? Wiener Schnitzel. Yeah. I, I hate that dogs. That dogs are super, like the super skinny dogs. It tastes like, I don't, know you, I don't know what movie or cartoon where it's just like a big pot of hot dogs and they just reach in, they pull out those little whack dogs. That's what Winter Snitchel is for me. This chili dog was fire. I love the fact that they cut it. I love the fact that they throw it on the grill first. If you got the time to do it like that, that's the best hot dog. When you grill mm -hmm. that bad boy, you boil it a little bit to get it plump and then grill it, keep that heat on it, give it a look, look mm -mm -mm, from the grill, the season from the grill. Throw that joint on there with the chili on top. It's fire. I'm, I'm rocking with that. I'm matching, I'm matching the 10. Because yeah. I gave the fries a nine. I like that, the, the dog better. So, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and they didn't dump, like, Winter Central does dump the chili on top. Mm -hmm. So, I'm, I'll give it a 10. Next okay. up, shakes. Oh, uh, man. This mm. is heaven in a straw. I couldn't even pick it up without giving it a, a good taste before the rate. These are pretty fire. I'm going go nine. Mm. I don't know why. I'm not a shake person. I'm just hating, I guess. I would never go to a place and really order shakes. Not really my thing. So yeah, the fact same. that we ordered it just because we wanted to see what everything was on the menu. Very rich. Pleasantly surprised. Pleasantly surprised. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give it a 10. Not just because it's delicious, but it all surprised me. Took me back to like childhood. This is a big, this is a big rating for you. Hey, man, I'm out here. I'm, I'm really going to. Another thing is I've been eating like, like a monk for the last couple of weeks to lose his weight. Uh -huh. So all my food has been very bland. It's like been quinoa. Unseasoned oh, so chicken breast, just spinach. It's just, it's been, it's been, just, oh, I'm losing flavor, my mind. Flavor overload. I might go get my nipple spirits after this, guys. Jesus Christ! I yeah. don't know how Fat Burger was the, <laughs> the gateway to that. <laughs> hey man, go wow. all out, baby. He was one burger away mm -hmm. from getting his nipples pierced. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go first because you clearly really loved the burger salad. Yeah, go ahead. Do your thing. Impossible burger. Rating it towards a uh, regular burger. Oh, it's a zero. But in mm. terms of you trying to not eat meat, I'd give it a six. Mm. It was, I, there was really nothing, nothing too much about it. The, it looks good. The bread is kind of whatever, but the meat itself has a planty aftertaste that wasn't. I'm not a. Not a fan of. I've had better vegetarian burgers than this for mm. sure. So six. I give it a swell six. Well, well that's right. awesome. Now pile o burger. <laughs> I'm, burger. I'm gonna give this eight. Could have been a ten, okay, or a nine at least, had it been constructed the way I saw it on the picture. It's, That's why I ordered crazy. it. I thought it was gonna be so dope for y'all to see the burger, the two the two burger patties as the bun, and then everything else in the middle. Like they I was really excited. They too. have a picture That's of it. Crazy. There's a picture on the wall of this, man. They're like, so, nah, hit me with the old bait and switch. Um, who else for that? Yeah, it definitely could have been a 10 because it definitely reminds me of Whataburger. I told you my love for Whataburger and how delicious that is. Never so, had it. Maybe that's going to be a eat me out. 
Mm-hmm. Well, we're gonna really try not to make that catch, but <laughs> eat me out. <laughs> I'm getting on. I told you that was my slogan all 2022. E um, emo. <laughs> emo. Emo. Oh, the emo. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna go ahead and give that an eight. Okay. Overall, fat burger. Pleasantly surprised. I see why people would risk life and limb to come here and get it. Overall, the food was pretty good. It is dangerous. Solid, solid seven and a half across the board. Uh -huh. You can't go wrong with that. I feel like. Yeah, two tens. Yeah, that's what that that's what that would put the half right there. It would have been an eight had the fry, the original fry had been a little bit bigger, and if the onion ring had been like a seven, right. that would have been a solid eight eight and a half. But onion was a little bland. Bland. Uh, regular duck fries were a little bland. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, I mean, and and I'm really upset that the burger didn't look like how it was supposed to look. So, oh right, yeah, yeah. Points off for that. So seven, seven and a half for your boy for fat, fat burger. I mean, I said the fries were decent. The chili cheese fries and the chili dog was fire. Veggie burger I could do without, but then the milkshake came in. So I'm gonna give it an eight. Fat there burger, and it's and it's an it's an LA it's an LA thing. It's LA you know? staple. It it's is one of those staple. things we brag about, and then people travel here and they're like, I don't really get it. I I I get I get the hype, because at least a burger is good in the season. Like it's seasoned really well. In and out, you lost me. Don't get the hype. I don't understand a thirty-five. It's, it's car just what line. we got. It's yeah. just what we have to you got fight. Mc, you got McDonald's. Too. It's you like just... a flag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's what, that's the thing with food. You go to another yeah. city and you judge their food compared to yours. This is true. I judge cities by their food. I'm not gonna hold you. <laughs> <clears throat> well, listen, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching another episode of Lunchtime Lottery, the most delicious show on the web. Uh, shout out to Trueville, man. Hey. And maybe if you got a lot of subscriptions, just put it in there. We'll see what happens. Trueville. You might might realize like oh, I'm doing everything right. Or you might realize oh man, I could be saving hundreds of dollars every month mm -hmm. or every year. Uh, but thank y'all so much for watching, man. As always, I'm to hear more. I'm Patrick Cloud. And we'll see you on the next meal. Later, Peace, guys. guys. I'm going to try to edit. Put my hand up there. Uh, no, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, yeah. no.